Hey everyone, and welcome back. It's Gina from OrchidandOpal.com, and I am back today with the Eureka Crystal Beads Collection for July 2024. It's called Wild West Wonders. If you're interested in picking one of these up, you can follow the link that's right down below the video in the description section. It'll take you right to the collection page. And as a reminder, these are not a subscription. These are stunning individual collections of high quality beading materials put together by Eureka, which are available in limited quantities and released periodically throughout the year. Let's go ahead and dig into this one so we can take a close-up look at everything that's included. They do such a great job putting these packages together. It's always so inspiring, so I cannot wait to see personally what's inside. All right, so we got the cowboy boots here and hat. It looks like we're gonna see some turquoise, maybe some shades of brown, which would be a great contrast. Our inspirational paragraph says, as the orange dust crunches beneath your boots and the warm wind brushes against your cheeks, you savor the freedom of the open range. Fix your cowboy hat and let your compass guide you towards the wonders of the West and the wild vastness of inspiration. And then inside of our insert, that's where you see the listing of everything that's included, including the SKU numbers over there on the right-hand side. If you type those into the search bar on Eureka's website, it'll tell you the specific color names and all about each of these products that are included. And it's good for me to note that if the collection is relaunched at a later date, it's possible that the contents could vary slightly, but the overall value will remain the same. Now, Eureka Crystal Beads, they ship anywhere in the world, and the shipping cost just depends on your location. However, if you're in the U.S., you get free shipping on all orders over $39.99, so that would include this collection. And keep in mind, they make amazing gifts for your fellow bead enthusiasts. And they have some other collections still available on their website you can check out. I also have the link for that down below because you're more than welcome to pick up more than one collection and enjoy even more inspiration that way. And the fact that there is a savings overall on the retail cost of all these products if you purchase them as part of the set. So as you can see though on the list, we're gonna start out with the seed bead section, then we're gonna go into the check glass beads. There's some single and multi-hole beads there. Also a number of crystal components, some gemstone beads like we got a peek of, and some findings. So I'm excited, I have the package right here. This is our sneak peek. Before we get into everything, you can see it's loaded with very on theme colors, even some stones in there. So let's start out by taking a peek at these seed beads. Got some in those tubes, which are a great foundation to get us started with the color palette and some of the other fun and exciting things inside. All right, so beginning with our size 11 seed beads, those are in the tube on the left. They are the Miyuki brand, and we have about 10 grams included. This one looks to be a metallic bronze, which is a great neutral metallic to go with the greenish turquoise that we see. And it picks up some of the neutral tones in the next mix, which is the Miyuki round seed beads mix. These are the Picasso finished seed beads. They've got a little bit of that variegated color, makes them look more stone-like and toned down. And what's great about this mix is they're all in the same color and finish, but we've got the size, it looks like 15 O's, 11 O's, maybe some 8 O's all together in that tube. So that is gonna be really handy. And then next up, we have the eight and a half gram tube of Miyuki Bugle Beads. They are in that six millimeter length and great quality, those Miyuki Bugles. They are a bit more uniform and usually cut a little bit more cleanly than some of the other lower quality Bugle Beads from a long time ago. So those will come in handy for some unique bead weaving projects and embroidery, among other things. 
And we also have a tube of the Toho Treasures, similar to the Miyuki Delicas in the little tube shape. That's a two and a half inch tube in this really deep matte frosty chocolate brown color. Another fantastic neutral to go along with our turquoise. All right, next up, let's look at some Czech glass and I'll unbag these two separately. We've got a couple strands to check out. Oh, that copper color is just everything with this palette. I feel like it's kind of a brushed metallic. And that is a whole strand of the four millimeter size. There's about 50 pieces included. And then next to that, we have a strand of 50 pieces of the Czech glass English cut beads in a three millimeter size. And those look to be in a very dark color, almost black. You can see the difference in the shapes and sizes of those two styles of beads. The English cut being a little bit more spherical, but they have that kind of subtle band that goes around the center, just how those beads are pressed together. And these are both great options to include with the seed beads and our other components we'll be looking at so that we have variety to work with to put things together and play around with. And then the next two items in the check glass section come in these two, two and a half inch tubes. We've got the super duos and the two whole ginkgo leaf beads. These both look like they coordinate fabulously. And I'm going to take some of these out so we can get a close up look at these, especially those ginkgos. So there's our two two hole shapes. And I just absolutely love the ginkgos. If you've been around here for a little bit, you know I've had these on my channel before. I've worked with these and they come in a number of different colors. These happen to be that turquoise with the Apollo gold and bronze coloring that shows up kind of swirling around parts of the front and back, all of them being a little bit different. And then of course our classic two hole super duos there in the opaque turquoise green. Of course, these collections wouldn't be complete without some crystals. And we have a bag here of all sorts of different sizes and colors that we will take a look at together. And just look at these gorgeous crystals in the Krakowski brand. That's Eureka's brand of crystals and pearl beads. I love that we have another mix here because it's including these coordinating stones that you can pick out and use separately or together. We've got several decent pairs included, like the 12 millimeter cushion cut. Those have a gorgeous aqua crystal underneath that golden wash on top. And that also shows up on these other two varieties. Looks like some perhaps 10 and 12 millimeter Rivoli's. Those have a dark blue, like a navy. These are a bit more clear or very light silver. And then also included are some of these eight millimeter Chaton stones, like this light Colorado gold, kind of a champagne color. And then that deeper tone of topaz, we have a pair of those as well. And then also in the Krakowski section is a strand of about 100 pearls. They are a four millimeter size and I'm loving the color, which is really unique. It's kind of a light mocha or taupe. And I think it would blend very well with your golds, even silvers though, bronze, copper. It kind of is one of those colors that goes with pretty much anything. All right, that brings us to the next section, which is the Elite Crystal section, another one of Eureka's brands, this one being very high quality, meeting a standard that's similar to Swarovski Crystal. And we've got this pack of 24 gorgeous light aqua colored bicones that have stunning clarity and sparkle. You can see up close how gorgeous those are. That brings us to our gemstone section, and I've got this handful of natural Amazonite 8mm cube beads. There's a total of 15 of those included in the package, 
and they vary just slightly from bead to bead because they are more natural, not just in the color, but just some subtle variations in the sizes and shapes. All of them being pretty well smoothed out though, having those rounded out corners and that rich burst of turquoise color with the little tiny striations of neutrals. I love how well these complement our overall palette, but also the fact that we're getting some of these more natural materials, which lends itself to our Wild West theme with its slightly more rustic feel that's specific to this collection. And then second, we have a strand of the high-grade faceted gemstone beads that are so tiny and sparkly and compact with a variety of colors, also neutrals along with the greenish turquoise, really pulling together those browns and tans. If you squint, you can almost transport yourself to a warm, sun-drenched canyon with that vibrant turquoise that could represent some refreshing water flowing through. And that covers everything for the beads in this collection, but we do have a number of coordinating metallic components and some findings, even a little bit of cord. And we'll start out with the set of two symbol bead endings. These are specifically for the size 80 seed beads. You can see right there how it's got the loop included, and that is so that you can bead directly into this type of component. And when incorporated that way, it's meant for these to seamlessly finish off your beadwork in a high quality and detailed way. You can also see the loops there on either side. Those are there so you can attach them to a clasp or jump rings and further complete your pieces. And as you can see on one side, they have that more detailed fan-like shape. And there's a look at the other side, just kept flat and a little bit more plain. But I love these types of symbol components. They're very high quality and definitely match the quality of the beads in this collection. And then up next, we have the set of two pairs of ear wire findings. They have the two millimeter ball detail. And there you also see the small toggle clasp with the feather accent, which is very well done and definitely on point with this theme. You could certainly combine the ear wires with those symbol components we took a look at first, and you could also include the clasp with those. They both coordinate very well in terms of their antique golden color. And then next we have these awesome accents. A set of four of the horseshoe slider beads, seven by eight millimeter, and they've got a hole that goes right there through each of those ends of the horseshoe. So you could even frame out another smaller bead in between those or just show off some of your cord if you want to leave that open. And then this really stunning Western oval button. It's a 25 millimeter piece. Feels really special. It's got the turquoise color accents kind of looking like verdigris and more of a copper color metallic component with a loop at the back, as you can see, something that you could use as a potential clasp or even as a focal component, part of a pendant. Both of these really adding to that Western feel of the collection. And then we have our final two items, the Eureka Basics crimp tubes in the two millimeter size. It's a pack of 50 in the coordinating antique golden color. I feel like I can always use more of those crimp tubes. And they've also included a package of the Griffin natural silk beading cord. We've got two meters included. This one happens to be in a deep chocolate brown color, a great choice for stringing projects and could certainly come in handy with some of these crimp tubes and those little horseshoe beads, some of the gemstone beads, and it even includes a little needle there that's pre-threaded for you to go ahead and start using that to string on your beads. So that's another fabulous collection from Eureka. I just love unboxing these with you all. They're so inspiring, especially when everything is laid out and it really makes me want to start playing around and putting things together, especially since they've taken all the guesswork out of picking out the color choices. Everything is made to coordinate well inside of each of these collections with so many possibilities. 
And each time they offer one of these packages, they're all a little bit different in terms of the colors and the theme, which keeps things fresh and exciting, I think. And it's also a way to build up your stash over time of all different high quality goodies with these collections usually being launched every month or two, typically on the first Thursday of the month. This time we had the holiday, so they delayed it by a week. But if you check out my channel on the first Thursday of August, you're going to see another fun surprise. So be sure to subscribe here if you haven't already. That way you'll be notified as they're launching future collections and possibly some projects to come inspired by the contents that you see here. You can also check out Eureka's YouTube channel and sign up for their newsletter for more updates and project ideas using a lot of the items from their collections. And this is just a taste or a sampler of what's included in their online shop. They've got so many different things to take a look at so you can have fun looking at all of the treasures in a rainbow of color choices. So as usual, I love what they have put together for us. I'd love to hear your thoughts, so please feel free to leave a comment down below. Also, feel free to share if anything stands out to you. Maybe you have an idea that came to mind as you were checking out this unboxing. Feel free to share that below in the comments section. Also, share the video with your other beading friends. As a reminder, the link for this collection is located right down below the video in the description section. It'll take you right to it on their website, and you're welcome to browse their other collections. They may still be offering right now, which could also be a beautiful compliment to this one. That wraps it up for now, though. I want to thank you all so much for being here and for watching. If you enjoyed this video, you can go ahead and give it a big thumbs up. I hope to see you all real soon, and until next time, I want to wish you all a fabulous rest of your day. And as always, happy beating.